India is paving the way for a sustainable future, a brighter tomorrow. In a bid to achieve the renewable energy capacity milestone and realizing the vision of PM Narendra Modi of attaining the target of 450 gigawatts by 2030, the Union Minister for Power and New and Renewable Energy, R.K. Singh, unveiled the Green Day Ahead Market, GDAM. The newly launched DDAM aims to strengthen electricity trade in India by opening doors for renewable energy. The aim is simple to promote industry players to set up and sell renewable energy on the exchange, therefore enabling them to go green. Not only is it a step towards boosting the country's renewable energy capacity, but also reducing dependency on imported sources of fossil fuel. The government is working to implement the Green Hydrogen Mission, stated Power Minister R.K. Singh. A platform marketplace has been designed for trading renewable power on a day-ahead basis. Requisite technologies have been set up by the National Load Dispatch Centre, Power System Operation Cooperation Limited, as the nodal agency for the launch of the GDA. This step has been taken to rescue the energy companies from suffering a loss of the revenue in case any electricity distribution company refuses to buy their electricity. Termed as a unique product launch in the energy market, the Green Day Ahead market is here to influence and aid in the energy transition. As the world is witnessing the wave of the energy transition, India is also committed to renewable energy goals by transitioning from fossil fuel to non-fossil fuel sources. The power market is witnessing an ever-changing, dynamic environment as there is a significant shift in the buyer's behaviour from long-term contracts to short-term contracts. GDAM is launched to achieve the last mile goal, India's green targets of 450 gigawatts by the year 2030. The day ahead market will felicitate the integration and expansion of green energy in an efficient, competitive, sustainable and transparent manner. Apart from fulfilling the energy capacity goals, GDAM is here to offer multiple benefits. GDAM is aimed to offer competitive price signals as well as an opportunity to the market participants to trade in green energy in the most transparent, flexible, competitive and efficient manner. The market-based competitive prices will lead in the boost of renewable capacity addition towards the government's vision of building India as a sustainable and efficient energy economy. Benefits of free ISTS, that is Interstate Transmission System, will be available for renewable energy and open access will be available within 15 days. Other benefits of GDAM include reduction of containment of green power, assured instant payment to renewable energy generators on the day of delivery itself and tapping into the unlocked renewable energy potential of India. It is pertinent to note that GDAM is designed to operate in an integrated way with the conventional day-ahead market but with a separate clearing mechanism and price discovery for both the renewable segment and conventional energy segment. The buyers and sellers will be able to submit their bids together for both conventional and renewable energy through separate bidding windows. In the first round, the priority will be given to renewable energy bids in the clearance followed by the conventional segment. This will allow the renewable energy centers to place their bids in the conventional segment in case their renewable segment bids remain uncleared. Both segments will have separate price discoveries. India is the world's third largest consumer of electricity and the world's third largest renewable energy producer. GDAM is a step towards realizing energy goals. Well, that is all for today's segment. Thank you for watching.